high viewers today i'm going to show us how to connect how to send files from your device from your from your cell phone from your uh, android devices to your to your laptop without using any cord to connect your phone to your system so now just follow me carefully and i put it on this thing first i'm going to on my device hotspot i on my device hotspot then i'll come to my system go to come to this wi-fi con this this wi this the wi-fi on my system then click on it then come to look at my phone the techno spark 8c i'll click on it then next i'll now click on connect and i click on connect and it will now ask me for my device password i'll now put my device password And I click on next. Yes. It has connected. Are you seeing it? It's telling me no, no, no internet connection because I didn't own my hotspot. I didn't own my data. So one one good thing about this thing is that you don't need your data to send. You don't need your data to send this thing. You don't need your data to be on before you can send files from your phone to your system. What you just need is just your, your hotspot and your Wi-Fi. And without any code, you can send files from your phone to your system and from your system to your phone. Then I, uh, what, what I will do now is I will just open any browser. So let me open this browser. If I open this browser now, I will open my, uh, uh, but I will first download Zender. I will download Zender on my, I will download Zender on my phone. I will download Zender on my phone. So I will open the Zender in my, in my, in my device. If I open the Zender. Then on that Zender, I'll click. There is a three dots up on that your Zender app. Then click on the three dots. Then click on connect, connect to connect PC. Then click on connect PC. Your phone will bring out a an IP code for you. And then your phone will bring out an IP code for you. Is that IP code that you that you will type here? So let me type my own IP code. One nine two. Dot, one. dot one six eight dot one two three dot one five eight then three three Four, five, five. I'll click enter. Then, it, then on my phone, I'll, I'll on my phone, I'll click on set, uh, accept. On my device, on my Android phone, I'll click on accept. I click on accept. Have you seen it? My phone has been connected to my system. Look at my phone. This is my phone. Look at. I can now send something from my phone to my system and from my system to my phone. As you I want to send, I want to send something. I want to send something from my phone to my. I was drag i won't send you a picture just drag this picture come to that browser then drop it on my phone i've sent it to my the, the device the thing i sent out my phone so if i still want to send from my phone if i want to send once to send from my phone to my device i'll still, i'll come to file then choose any 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 location the thing is stored i can now click click click, click, click. i can now uh, uh, click here and click on download i've seen it if i click on download it will enter my it will obviously it will download it will not enter my 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 phone so this is just a simple way to send some to send things from your phone to your device from your phone to your pc and from your pc to your phone without using any cord or any means of connection